I'm Dr. Scott Saunders with NaturalEDoctor.com here to talk about uh, omega-3 fatty acids. Everybody hears about their omega-3 oils. You've got to take your omega-3s today. And, and why is that? Well, let's talk about what that is. We have uh, the ability in our body to change from one type of oil to another for, to, in order to get all of the different types of things that we need. For example, most of our cholesterol is made in our liver. Uh, we often think that uh, all the cholesterol we eat is what ends up in our arteries, but 80% of it, for most people, comes actually from their liver. However, there are three different types of oils that we cannot make, that we have to eat. And those are called the essential fatty acids, or the essential oils. And they're essential because we have to eat them in order to have them, and if we don't have them, our body won't function properly. And that's omega-3, omega-6, and omega-9. Uh, those three different types of oils we have to ingest. So, um, what is the difference between them? Well, uh, omega-6 fatty acids are found in a lot of different vegetable oils. So, when we eat vegetable matter of any kind, we'll get a lot of omega-6 fatty acids. So, for example, if you uh, fry in corn oil, all your corn oil has a lot of omega-6. Uh, the reason this is important is when we eat large amounts of one, we throw out a balance of the other one. So, for example, the uh, omega-6 fatty acids are made into something called a prostaglandin that causes inflammation in the body. Omega-3 fatty acids are made into uh, uh, leukotrienes that, are, that suppress the inflammation in the body. So you have this balance of inflammation that, has, that is affected somewhat by what you eat. So there's a lot of omega-6s in the diet, and probably the right level is about six to one. You should have about six times as much omega-6 fatty acids as omega-3s. However, mostly in the American diet, it's 30 to one. So there's this wide variation. So people have a lot of extra inflammatory oils in their body, and they don't have enough omega-3s. So this 30 to 1 ratio is pretty easy to bring up to 6 to 1 by increasing your omega-3s, right? And so that's why you're told you have to get enough omega-3s, and you should eat your fish oil and take your oil tablets and drink your cod liver oil and all that stuff. But what you never hear is that your, the other option is to decrease the amount of omega-6 fatty acids you, you eat to get the normal ratio so that you bring it back into balance. 